Do you make use of the InShot app? If yes, then this video is for you. Adding the zoom effect to your videos makes your videos look less boring. I will show you how to add this particular effect to your videos using the InShot app. But before we proceed to the tutorial properly, I want us to observe how this video clip looks. Okay, so now let's dive into the tutorial properly. So first thing first, we have to divide this clip into three. So to split your clip, video clip, I would click on the clip, then go to trim, then click on split. Then this icon, I'm going to move to the particular part I want to, the split to um, start from, to end rather. Once I've done that, I, I'm going to make another one. I'll click on the clip, go to trim, split then this is it now if you can notice we now have three different clips now to add our zoom effects this is what you have to do move this white line to the particular place you want your zoom effects to take place once you've done that you click on canvas once you've clicked on canvas you pinch in to zoom pinch into zoom then let's let's leave it yeah okay now let's watch our video all over again PNG photos are basically images without background. So I'll be showing you how to add those images in your videos or your pictures. So first thing first, you have to go to Google to download any PNG photo image of your choice. Once you've downloaded it, you come back to your InShot app, then click on stickers. Once you've done that, you click on this image, then click on the plus button to import your image. PNG image to ancient so you can you can observe that there's no background in this particular image so I'm just going to reduce its size and bring it downwards once I'm done once I'm done I'll click on the image again then go to edit to add my transitions how do I want it to appear in so i'll just pick on something let's say i want this one now how do i want it to leave how do i want it to leave i'll just pick on this now let's observe this is how you add png photos in your videos Extracting songs from videos using InShot is quite easy. Now let's show you how to do so. Go to music. Then you go to effects. Now once you've done that, you click on my music. Then you click on extract audio from video. You will take him to your gallery. You click on the particular image, um, video you want to extract its song. Then you click on the check button. It's done. Let's see. To add black bars to your video using InShot is quite easy. All you need to do is go to Google, search for black images, then download. Once you've downloaded it, you go back to your InShot app, go to stickers. Now, once you've gone to stickers, you click on this particular icon here. 
then import your black image i've already imported mine here yeah, that's why it's easier so i'm just gonna then click on another one too because i need to apply at the top and at the end so once i'm done i'm gonna click on this button here then start the process i'll move one up then i'll move one down now this particular one i'm going to increase it yep like this make sure it's straight then move it yeah this place then this other one i'm going to try to increase it also then move it down make sure it's straight now once you've done that you move the icons you move them to the end of your videos you move this to the end of your video now let's watch it's really really cool one two